Hi, I am MD Kaushik, actor and musician from Bangalore. I hope you have purchased a few magic kits from me. Now I am going to show those magic tricks, both demonstration and tutorial. For example, these are the magic items you bought from me. Now, I take this magic book. See, magic book is beautiful, you know. Just I have a book in my hand that is empty. Nothing is there. But when I say abracadabra, you are going to get something. Just watch. Some picture has come. But black and white. What is the use? I want colorful life. One, two, three, abracadabra. Now you see color. So life should be colorful. Now I will show the uh, tutorial. See actually this book has three stages. First stage, second stage and third stage. When I say empty, you have to open in the bottom. It will come empty. Then you have to bring your hand in the center and you should open. Black and white will come. When I say color, you have to bring your hand completely to the top and open like this. Color will come. But while doing this magic, you are not supposed to shift your hand directly from here to here and here to here. In between you have to do all these kind of gestures. Then people will never notice that you are changing the place. That's all. This is magic book. Ha. Huh. Now the other magic. Duck and egg. Just watch. I have a plastic box. Open the cap. There is a duck. Now again I close it. And if I say abracadabra. The duck will lay the egg. Just see one, two, three. Abracadabra. Focus, focus. Lay the egg. Again I close it. And if I say abracadabra. That small egg has become a big duck. This is duck and egg magic. I will tell the tutorial now. This plastic box has got three compartments. One is the cap. And second one is the duck this is a separate plate empty in the back and third one is sticked egg there what we do when we open first doing the magic just we open the top cap show like this again you close it take the top with the second cap also see if, if you take like this egg will come again it is back don't show like this but finally Put it there and say abracadabra, that egg will become duck. This is duck laying the egg magic. This is cigarette and cigarette cap. This is cigarette vanishing magic. This cigarette will vanish and become a small micro cigarette. Just watch. There is a cap for the cigarette. I will put this cigarette inside this like this and close the cap. Now. If I say abracadabra, you are going to see something change. One, two, three. Let that cigarette vanish. I open. See no cigarette here. But you can see a small cigarette. No cigarette inside. This is cigarette vanish and micro cigarette creation. Now I will come to the tutorial. See actually this container has have one small thread type of thing if you put inside that will take out the inside cigarette actually what we do before starting the magic we take the small cigarette and put it inside when we show this is cigarette and this is container then just we will insert when we insert it fix inside you cannot open it without this tool so when you just reverse like this the small cigarette will come. The real cigarette is inside. You cannot see. See, it will never come. But when it will come, I will show you. If you use this tool, the thread kind of place, put it inside and just remove like this. It will come like this. Again, you can put it back and take this thread down. Don't show anybody this thread and close this. This is cigarette vanishing and creation of small cigarette magic.
See, this is color changing disc magic. I have two small discs. This side is different color, but this side is only black. Now, if I say abracadabra, this color will change. See, just say one, two, three, abracadabra. Color is changed, both the sides. Now, I will tell the tutorial. See, actually, one side, there is a magnet disc. And I have a, another magnet to take out that disc. Just watch. If I press like this, there is a small disc. This we will keep it in top of this. And we will show us two side black and another side different colors. But when I put like this, that magnet disc will go back and change the color. That's all for this. You have to use this tool. But don't show these tools to others. Just keep it in the pocket and before starting the magic, you can use this. Otherwise, just this changing magic. That's all. This is big black dice to small color dice conversion magic. Just watch. I have a big dice in this box. Now, if I say, you can see big dice. If I say abracadabra, you will be surprised, you can see all small dice, where is the big dice, it is vanished, converted into small dice, that's all. Now the tutorial, actually this cap, inside there is a magnet and there is one big dice without bottom. What we do, we keep this small, 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 small dice inside this big cap you can see how nicely we can arrange see this is the way we will arrange dice now we are going to put this inside like this and show us one dice and cap has got inside there is a magnet when I close this and just do like this what happens only small dice will leave in the bottom and the big dice stick in the top. That's all. This is big dice to small color dice. This is coin changing magic. I have one coin box. Just this is the cap. I will play like this. Just see there is one coin in this coin box. That is one rupee coin. I will put it back. You can see. Now I will close this. If I say abracadabra, that coin will change to 2 rupees coin. Just watch. See. It has changed to 2 rupees. And again I can close this. And I can see an empty cap. I will put it inside. If I say abracadabra, you will be surprised that is again one rupee coin. This is coin changing magic. I will tell the tutorial. See actually this coin box has got three compartments. One is cap. Another is second cap. Usually what we do two rupees coin we will put it in the bottom cap. Then this dummy cap will be put in that we will keep one rupee coin then we will close the cap first when we show we will show the first cap top coin that is one rupee but when we take next time we will take two caps together see here in top of that here nobody knows now you can see the second two rupees coin see they will be surprised again we will close this back and if I say abracadabra I take only the top cap you can see the one rupee coin. This is coin changing magic. This is obedient ball magic. See, I have a ball here. It will come down. See, just any ball will come like this because of gravitational force. But if I give some powers, this magic ball will become obedient ball. Just watch. Abracadabra, focus, focus, gili gili, goomba. Don't come down. See? It is not coming down. If I say come little, little, it will come. Come, 
Come little, come, hey, hey, stop, hey, 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 stop, hey, hey, stop, yes. You come fast, it will come fast. Come slowly, it will come slowly. Or it can stop in the middle, ting, 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 ting. This is obedient ball. I will tell you the magic behind this. This ball has got a curved hole in the center. When they put this thread inside, that is curved like this and going outside. So when you keep in loose tension, it will come down. Just it comes down like a regular ball. But when you hold tight both the sides, the center curve will hold the ball in the same spot. See, if I give a little lenience, if I lose the thread, it will come down. When it is coming down, if I tight, it will stand. Again it will stand. Again it will stand. So the secret is, you have to tight the, both the sides, it will stand. If you lose, it will come down. This is obedient ball. Okay, this is a coin multiplying magic. Just I have two coins here. See, this is an empty plate. I am going to put one, two. Just watch. If I say abracadabra, you will have lot of coins. Actually, there was only two in the top. When I say abracadabra, so many coins comes. How it is, I will show you. Actually, these two coins are in the top only. But there is one small slide here. In that slit, we will keep three coins by hiding this way. But when you close like this, it is not visible. Just you see only two. Nothing is there. But when I put like this, if I put my hand here and drop the bottom coins and top coins both comes together. Look like multiplying coin. This magic is as good as duck laying the egg magic. But just watch this. This is big dice will become small dice. One, two, three. There is a big dice. Nothing in the back. But if I say abracadabra, the big dice will turn into small dice. So again, if I say abracadabra, it will become big, big dice. This is also same. Three compartments. One is top. The second one is big dice. And small one is small dice. This big dice place, the small will hide. In that, we are going to put this. Yeah, that's all. Big dice and small dice. That's all. This is dice prediction magic. I have a plastic box and a small dice. It's a normal dice. I will put it inside. Now you can see it is 4. I will close this and I can predict what is the next number. Just say that is 5. See 5. Again I predict the next one is 2. See 2. I will come to the tutorial now. See actually let it be any number in the top. When you show to the audience it will be like this. But from back side whatever number you see. See that is 3. It is towards my side. But towards it is 1. It is towards is 3. If I say 3 that is the next number. Just watch now. If I say See, 3 has come. Now it is 4 my side. Can you see? Again, if I say 4, that will become 3, 4 like that. Keep on changing. So that is the technique. You should see whatever number from your side. You have to predict that and shuffle like this. If you have any doubts, you can call me back. Hmm. See, this is actually a puzzle. There is a ring which is welded both the sides. So inside the spring there is a ring this you cannot take it out see even if you bring wherever you bring it cannot come out because there is a welding both sides but in magic I can do it in one second just if I say abracadabra you will be surprised I can take out the ring but everybody cannot take the ring out see because both the sides are welding and again put it inside just if I say abracadabra it is coming See, now it is inside. Nobody can take out. 
what is this puzzle i will tell you if you take any way it will never come out because both the sides are welded then how we can take it out very simple in the back side of your back just do this gimmick just turn anti clockwise it will come and again put inside and turn clockwise it will lock inside so anti clock and clock but don't do in front of the audience just do it in the back so it will come out very easily and again if you put anti clockwise it will go inside that is the beauty of this puzzle question mark symbol iro ond tool idrinda now eshtu bekaru thooka idr mel haki just you can balance like this nodi hage bitre ing bandu this is another magic tool look like question mark it's a plastic tool what about this very interesting see if you hold like this it will fall without any extra weight here it falls because it is physics because of the gravitational force but the magic of this is something superb i take a belt see such a powerful and weight belt i will just put it here you can see i can put the belt here but now if i try i can balance this just watch i am not holding that you can see once again i will show you watch see till down the camera he will show the camera till down like this and come to here see it is hanging again come up look this is the beauty but whereas if i remove this weight it will fall so this is the beauty of magic but there is no tutorial for this whoever does it comes like this that is the beauty of physics thank you. this is coin vanishing trick i have a small pocket with a transparent uh, cover see you can see the coin here this is the coin now just i vanish this coin invisibly just watch i take this coin invisibly it is vanished no coin here you can see nothing is there see there is no coin but again if i just take from sky and put it back that is the beauty coin came back i will tell the tutorial actually this bag has got two separate one is this one and again there is one small entry here see this is the place where you can put the coin i will show you that when it will come outside i will show you see this is a coin and this is the bag one extra pocket and one small pocket you are going to put the pocket in this a small pocket it looks outside as a outside only but actually it is inside when i just turn like this it will go to the hidden area so nobody comes to know just behave like this and pretend like this again when you turn from your side like this it will come back but don't show to the audience just do on your side drop like this and again bring back like this that's all this is a boat kind of thing but excellent magic and it's a puzzle actually you can see there are two balls inside and there are two small holes here the puzzle is like this you have to put this ball this side and that ball that side but nobody can do this because they will try like this the both ball comes here or if they do like that both ball comes here and you are not supposed to use any magnet just you have to put both the balls both the sides how it is people will do lot of attempts but nothing will be succeeded only one method is there that is just take both the balls this side and that side in the center now you can see both the balls are there just i'll keep like this and if you turn like this then you can see this ball this side and that ball that side 
you can see the difference. If you go a little back, shadow will be not there. Yes. This is coin vanishing and restoring magic. I have a small plastic coin holder. See, just as you know, I have a coin here. I will put it inside. First coin and second coin also. Now, I vanish one coin invisibly. So there is only one coin. Again I put this back. I take the other coin. No, you will be surprised. There will be two coins. I will tell the tutorial. Actually keep one coin down. Show the empty place. But before showing it, there are two small mark here. If you put your hand here, you will have some lines. It obstruct your finger. Hold your first finger there and put the coin and second coin also put it like that. But when you want to put the coin down, just hold that impression place in your right side and just drop only one coin will come because there is a small slide inside the other coin will hide. But when you put this back coin just from the opposite direction, very soft, you know, there is no any lines or mark. There you drop, both the coin comes. That's all. This is number prediction magic. There is one extra card from 1 to 52. Numbers are printed here. Likewise, another 8 cards. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. But few numbers are punched. That number is missing here. But rest of the numbers are there in the cards. So just ask your counter person to keep one number in their mind. They should not tell the number. They should keep it in their mind and hand over this card. If they find their number, they should keep with them. Otherwise, they have to give it back. If they have their number, they should keep with them. Otherwise, they have to return. Like that, they will keep so many cards with them and they will return few cards. So just to take all the cards and place this in the bottom. Don't tell them what you are doing. Just act like doing some mesmerism, doing some gestures in magic and you say your prediction number is 22. They will say yes because there are so many holes. When you place this card in the bottom and all others whole card in the punched card in the top, which have only one number is visible through this hole, that number is there keeping number. That's all. This is pyramid magic. See, just I am going to drop like this. Then I will ask the person to arrange the pyramid back in this table. They will do so many attempts. They do like this. They do like this. They do like this. Whatever they do, it is not possible to arrange the puzzle. But now I can without showing you, I will arrange the puzzle. Just I will hide my hand and show you now. So the pyramid is ready. See. Come here, show. I will tell the secret. Keep the phone there only. See, just after putting it down, this is the procedure to form the pyramid. Take the bigger one. Keep here. Take the 3-3. Three, three. Balls keep like this and this one keep like this and the last one keep like this. Now the puzzle is over. This is T puzzle magic. See actually we are going to place the T shape in this way. Then we will separate like this. And just we disturb these pieces in different places and ask the person to arrange it back to T shape. But they try, they try, try, try and they don't do that. But there is a small trick for that. Just watch, you can follow afterwards. This is the tutorial. Just keep this first like this. Then the next corner is like this. And then this one is like this. And the last one is like this. 
but definitely i will tell you even after practicing one or two times also you will be confused so that is the reason just take one photo of this in this gap and then you can practice and do well that's all this is three cups and three balls magic i have three glasses here and three sponges here just watch all three empty glasses i will just keep all this and like this now i take this and keep it here and just i will close this one two three the what i kept in the center will go to down and again three empty so now again i will going to do one two three i will keep this again one two three two has come in one place now the last one just watch i will keep it here one two three all the three is in the bottom i will tell the tutorial actually not three balls there are four balls you can call it as ball or a small square peg so what you have to do in these three cups in the center cup you have to hide this but you have to tell there are three cups empty three cups when you place first cup place it here second cup also with this extra ball place it here and the third one empty when you do this just say abracadabra focus focus already it is coming down then again say the empty one two and three again put it like this 1 2 3 now 2 again you say empty One two three, three. But actually, the extra one is always in the center. This is cup and balls. This is a magic pedal. There is a rabbit in the cap here also, this side also. But if I say abracadabra, the rabbit will vanish. Rabbit is not here, but rabbit is here. But again, if I say abracadabra, rabbit will come here also. rabbit will come here also this is the magic tutorial actually one side the rabbit is there the other side is rabbit is not there but when you say rabbit vanish just you do like that by that time turn like this and when you show that side is also empty just by turning like this turn like this it is empty again while coming turn like this or if you want to show the cap both the sides show like this and twist like this and show this side and again twist back and show this side this is the magic secret this is an excellent magic for kids they can enjoy by creating something this is an empty cap or empty glass and i have a magic wand when i do abracadabra something will come but nothing is coming but when you do proper chanting One, two, three, abracadabra, focus, focus, gili gili, gumba. A beautiful flower will come. This is excellent for kids. I will tell the secret. Actually, this cap has got a small metal piece in the bottom, and this flower is also having a magnet in the bottom. This flower stick is inserted in the empty magic wand like this. It will go inside now. nobody come to know there is a stick inside but it is in the bottom when you do first time don't put the magnet side so nothing will stick but when you say abracadabra and all put the magnet side that will come open that's all this is a small puzzle i have two pieces here and you possible you make this as a pyramid but people will do like this like this like this it is not possible but there is a way i will show you i can make the pyramid like this see it is unable but if if i try i can make the pyramid show from the close tutorial just watch alertly just watch take this one this one like this 
and join like this and keep this is pyramid you can again study this is the method that's all see this is monkey and donkey magic there is a monkey here and one more donkey here but which one is the big anybody will say this monkey is big and this is small donkey is small but now if i say abracadabra focus focus gili gili gumba now donkey has become big and monkey is small how it is possible this is just an illusion when you keep anything this side it looks bigger the same big donkey will become small when i keep that side see it look it's an, it's a naive illusion and again if i keep this monkey that side donkey becomes big this is the secret this is boy and girl magic see here is a boy this side there is a girl this side boy and this side girl now i take the girl this side so actually this is what you say boy no boy is here this side boy this side girl now i take this boy and what is this girl no girl is here this side is girl and this side is boy i will tell the magic actually only one side both the girl and boy is there another is just a colorful card when i show boy like this when i say there is a girl i will turn like this so actually this card i will push this way while turning it gives a picture of changing the card like this but actually the same card i am changing from this side to the side that's all this is pencil vanishing magic this is very similar to the same cigarette vanishing magic but still i will demonstrate see i have a pencil here you can write this i will put it in the container and then just i close this and if i say abracadabra the pencil is vanish watch 1 2 3 no pencil it is vanished the secret is like this this has got a inside place so when you want to open that pencil you should put this thing inside and open it that pencil will come back this is the way again you can put it back like this and close this that is vanished that's all you have to use this portion to insert it because actually i put the wrong portion that's why it didn't came out if you put the third portion it will come very easily i will show once again just put this portion and press and you can take this out that's all